even at this time. Thank you, thank you. Let's celebrate them. Let's put our hands together for them. Thank you. We are so privileged to have you. Thank you very much. Thank you. And at this time, we'll take the announcement for the upcoming week, and this will come to us through the Good News Network Studio. Please pay attention, even as you listen to the announcement. Hello everyone, you're welcome to Jesus House DC, a church where hope is restored and every God-given potential maximized. I'm Fabian Onuga, your anchor man holding it down this beautiful day and you're watching the Goodness Network. Jesus House DC celebrates Easter in a big way this year and for those that have not been around, here is what you missed today. It's about this This leaf, which signifies the re-entry of peace, the re-entry of the king, and the re-entry of salvation. At the foot of the Mount of Olives, right at the edge of the city gates, was a man and his friends. It was no ordinary man. We are going to kill you today. Watch this! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him. What did he do? upon the Lord for he is my strength fine your time has come to an end Barabbas Barabbas is a murderer and this man he let no man utterly exhausted dehydrated and weak with ribs partially exposed wounded and hurting all over his body and mucus gushing out of his nose. Do what that will out of his love for you and to me. Father, into your hands I commit my spirit. It is finished. This is how the week ended for the man heralded as the king of the Jews. Death. And this is what we call Good Friday. Hi, Jesus House DC. This is Ada Ijogu, um presenting to you what we're doing down here in downtown Silver Spring. 
Jesus House DC is doing its community Easter egg hunt. Give it up for everyone in the community. All right. is a story of a man that once lived and once died and came back to life. Let's have Jaden Lett. Congratulations, Jaden. You just won a big prize for you and your family. The Ignite team would like to say a big thank you to everyone who attended their services in the month of March. Your attendance and energy made each of the services a huge success. Ignite will be back on Sunday, April 10th at 10 a.m. Please invite a friend. If your career is an important part of your life and you seek an advancement or you are stuck at your current career level, the Career and Skills Department would like to assist you. Just send an email to info at csdjobcenter.com to schedule a one-on-one -on -one session with one of the coaches. You can also send an email if you're only interested in receiving weekly job postings. In the midst of the Easter celebrations, let us remember that the real reason we celebrate is Jesus' death for the remission of our sins and his resurrection, which guarantees our salvation and reassures us that we serve a living and not a dead God. One who is able to forgive the worst of sins and bring life to every dead situation or area of our lives. No matter where you are and no matter how hopeless it may seem, just come to him and the power of his resurrection will make a way for you. From all of us here at the Good News Network, Happy Easter. Praise the Lord. And also the JJN um, Church, that's the teenage church, the children that ministered to us in song um, earlier on, um, will like the adults, their parents, their grandparents, uncles, aunties to know that they have a lot of things planned for the summer. Uh, that will cost them money and they do not want to be coming directly for money all the times. And in view of that, they said they want to be having um, some big sale, whatever it is, to raise some fund for themselves starting from next week Sunday. So you will see them outside. They want to, um, they need our help to solicit for their help and to be of help to them. So please don't ignore them. Uh, I believe every Thanksgiving Sunday they will be outside doing some big sale or whatever. They want us to patronize them and be a source of blessing unto them. Uh, we have one of our sisters who uh, celebrated her 48th uh, birthday and she's having a Thanksgiving, uh, Sister Fumi Fajemi Dukbe. If we can please quickly take that now. Let's rejoice with her on the day of your rejoicing. God will cause people to be there for you also. So let's celebrate our dear sister and then we'll bring the service to a close. God bless you.